Good morning, little boy. Good morning. <laughs> Was you awake? <laughs> you collecting your Ted Ted's? I've got all of them. <laughs> and I've got your mushies. <gasps> oh, you got your dumpfitter dummy. You found your dumpfitter tiger. <laughs> Come here. <laughs> Good morning, I fam. Happy Monday to you all. This morning's definitely got. Is Prinny going in your bedroom? This morning's definitely got a bit of a springer in my step because it's the first Yay! It's the first of February today, which I'm very happy about. I'm very happy to see the back. Hello, Mama. Hello, Mama. Hello, Jace. <laughs> I'm very happy to see the back of the longest month ever this year. It's been a long one, hasn't it, Jace? Jace is little fidget thing arrived this morning every time a dimple every time the girls order one of these things online jace like wants it <laughs> wants it and obviously can't have it because it's not his so i need to start remembering to like order him one that i think he'll really like these are actually for toddlers and he absolutely loves it i'm so glad jace has arrived this morning because the girls don't often let you play with theirs do they well i mean they do don't they, they share all the time <coughs> So me and Jace are trying to be pink. Yeah, he got pink pink. He's obsessed with the colour pink. Um Chris has got off early this morning and gone off to the office. Uh, there's some things there that need unpacking and also packing up your orders from over the weekend and things and there's some paperwork and stuff like that that needs filing. Also we're paying for what darling? <laughs> We've still got our old offices. I know that we moved, um, was it in December? Moved in December at the start, but we still have our old offices just because We've just been using them for like storage and things, but we're giving the keys back to those today and we're just having the two. I think we're down to two now. So my big one and then another storage one, which has got some storage and things in there from stock. So he's gone to sort all that out today. And me and Jace are trying to be quiet because everyone's doing the schoolwork, aren't they, Jace? Uh, and mama. Yeah, me and Mama. You and Mama. So everyone's doing it their own schoolwork. Mama. It feels really nice. They're all in their own bedrooms. Mama. Mama is home. That is at the office, isn't he? Should we go see what Isla's doing? Yeah. Should we go have a quick check? She's okay. Yeah. Should we go check? Come on then, let's go see Isla. Can you take that dummy out? Why is that in your mouth? Can you take that out? I'm gonna put it in your bed. He's like, no, I'm putting it back in my mouth. <laughs> Hi. Hello, yeah. little miss. Just thought we'd come and see if you were doing okay. Yeah. It's school work in PJs today. It's not, it's not what we usually do, is it? No. We usually get up and get yeah. dressed and stuff first, but. Yeah. Everyone's just, I mean, she's put lipstick on, so. <laughs> you need some, re some reading? Yeah, um, I'm on Jordan Mama's Medicine, one of my favourite books in the world. Um, and they Hello, Mama. Oh. Hello. Well done, Isla. That's really cool. So we've, we've decided to do the print offs of like everything that's, that they need to do during the day. Sometimes I feel like when I say, like, we're going to do this, 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 and this, they're like, what? What did you say we were doing second? So I feel like if I just print everything out on a night time with like a clear timetable on what's to be done for the day. <laughs> Give me a kiss. What are you doing? <laughs> you don't put wiping it off. Uh, so today it's got like the date on it and it's really good if the L you know the t education board wants proof on like what we've been doing. Yeah. And um, we've got like the date on there. Hello Jace. Is your tonky head on the camera? <laughs> Jace has been so funny. Isla, I'm going to leave you to it, okay? okay? Come on, you. I didn't want to keep disturbing Isla while she was reading. Uh, so, basically, what I was saying was, I think it's better that we print out, like, on an A4 sheet what's expected of them, like, that day. So, like, today we've got the day, and then she's got... And her and Esme have got 10... I think there's 12 for Esme. Or 15, I can't remember now how many we did but they've got spellings to do for the week and we're going to do a spelling test on friday that's one thing we've not been doing we have been doing spellings as in like spelling random things and when they've done hello jace <laughs> when they've been writing stories if there's ever been like a spelling mistake we'll go over that spelling but we've not done like set you know 10 to 15 spellings per week so hello jace so we've started to do that and then um, she's got a half an hour reading, Esme's got 45 minutes reading, and then they've got English, 
biology and history. Most of the lessons take around half an hour to complete. We always get questions about homeschooling, that's why I'm telling you guys all this. We don't do long, massive... What darling? Get down off there! Can't stand on there! Stop that! I told you, that's naughty! Hot! <laughs> it's not hot. And it doesn't, oh daddy's ringing me. Oh my gosh, it's all a bit full on this morning, isn't it? He's telling you he's found Hello, a dummy darling. and he's got it. I've tried been not letting him have dummies as much. He's like, I found one daddy and I got it, ha ha. Oh, you got an Emni. <laughs> <laughs> well, that was a crazy few minutes. <laughs> Pretty wanted letting out. The postman was knocking on the door, I was on the phone. To Chris, Jace was shouting, Grinch on, Grinch. Whew, you know when everything, it's just really quiet and peaceful in the house and then all of a sudden everyone starts happening, everything starts happening at once. Anyway, all settled. Jace, what do you want to watch? Ginch. Is it bad that I'm letting Jace watch The Grinch in February? Are we in February? We're in February. Anyway guys, the postman's just been, there you go. The postman's just been, and I've got a lovely friend. She's got a small business, and she's such a lovely, lovely lady. And I, I speak to her most days, and she keeps sending me amazing gifts from her small business. Obviously she's not ever said, can you, help promote my business or anything like that because she's done it as a friend not as like I'm sending this so that you can help me out but her items are so beautiful that I can't not show you guys and also I'm not sure you guys are going to get the same treatment because like I said we are friends but every time she sends me a treat she sends me a chocolate bar <laughs> I absolutely love her for it because I don't know it's rare that I'll buy myself is it rare it's rare that I'll buy oh no I said that too loud Jace is now shouting chocolate bar um, anyway, she always sends the cutest ones. Look at this, guys. Look at this. I need to hide it somewhere because I've been hiding them and eating them myself. But the last one she sent me, it's it's made me like totally addicted to them. And it's the Cadbury's mini eggs. You know the new Cadbury mini eggs in like a yellow packet. Oh my gosh, it's a bar. Just the same size. They're so good. And since then, I've not been able to find them in any shop anywhere. But they're so nice. I'm really looking forward to trying this one. Anyway. A page is called Maddie Pe Maddie's Pegs, M-A-D-D-I-E-S, Pegs, Maddie's Pegs. And I'm just about to open this one. I know it's going to be amazing because what she's sent me so far has just been so, so cute. So I'm going to open these now and show you guys them. You can find her on Instagram. Let me uh, open these and show you guys what they are. Oh my gosh, you guys, seriously, how cute are these? Oh my gosh, I absolutely love them. They're so cute. They're going to look amazing on Jace's shelf. So you guys can check her on Instagram, maddies underscore pegs. Hi everyone, so Emma Isabel has actually just made some of this like pasta stuff with cheese in it for lunch. And I just had it and it was so so good. Anyway, I've just come back upstairs to finish off what I've been working on down here. So my desk chair, and my desk is like, this chair is really comfortable and I love it so much. Anyway, I have been working on this. Now you might be wondering what it is, but basically I've got some white tack stuff here and there's some more downstairs, but you pull, you colour in this as much as you want and you cut it out the exact size of your light switch and then you can just blue tack it on. I'm not sure what dad will say to this but it's safe because I'm not actually painted on that, the actual light switch so I'm sure he'll like it anyway and I've got to make one for Isla because she wants one and I'm going to make one for Isabel she wants one and I'm just going to make this one for me so keep some flower one with a sky background as you can see just sketched it out and I'm colouring it in. Okay now I'm just going to flatten down the blue bit on the end because as you can see it's kind of like like scratchy kind of thing so I'm gonna I'm gonna get my special thing I've got quite a few of these I've got some thin ones and some medium ones but I'm gonna use a thick one and it's already got loads of green and I don't want to put any green in it oh I'm like this has got loads of red so I'm just gonna sand it all down I think this is sandpaper I honestly don't know it feels and looks like sandpaper and it works like sandpaper so I'm sure it is so it takes quite a long time to actually like get it to be smooth with colour pencils but with a normal regular pencil it actually works really well but with coloured it doesn't work so well so I'm just trying my hardest and it is changing a tiny bit but it doesn't really it just like smudges all the blue stuff into like a light blue colour into the white part but it looks better I guess and now I'm going to colour in the actual flowers Well, 
what you can see it really well in real life but there's all cute stars and little highlights and now I've got my white tack I'm now gonna go stick it on my light now let's stick it on <gasps> this looks so cute so I came back from the office today and we just all decided collectively as a family we were getting so fed up with the house and the same old same old routine in and out that we literally got on the internet we booked a clip at Forest Holidays and we've just arrived. How you wish! <laughs> So we've come, we've, yeah, we've travelled five minutes from the house into the forest. I wish this was forest holidays in Cropton, but it's not. It looks like yeah. to be fair, this, yeah, yeah. This, this road, the path. It does. It's very, that's what I'm saying. That's what I'm saying. It's very, very icy today. It's one of them days that's just gorgeous and sunny and cold and perfect for winter walks. So that's what we're doing right now. So, so nice. like the type of person they are depending on where they are so for example right now I'm in the woods and I, I literally want to be a wood a wood woman I want a cottage in the woods I want to live in the woods I want to be in the woods but if I was at the seaside or the coast then I'd be a beach person and I'd want a beach at the coast a and a beach at the sea too. if I was in the mountains I'm a mountain woman and I want a beach I mean I want a cottage in the mountains it's like I literally just love everywhere but Right now, I feel like I feel like I'm a wood woman. I want to live in the woods, forest. But I also quite like the idea of living in the co living at the coast. And I also like the idea of living in the mountains. And I also like the idea of living somewhere really hot. But I love the idea of living somewhere cold as well. <laughs> uh, the girls are climbing trees. The younger two. Wow! Wow! Well, your hood's come down, don't it? Up. No, you took down. Me and Jace are looking at the trees. Where are all the big trees, Jace? Up. They're really high up, aren't they? Are they big? Down. You want to get down? Yay! <laughs> Go on then. <laughs> Whee! Wow! What are you doing, Jace? Are you climbing a big tree? What's Isla doing? A seesaw. A seesaw? It looks like a seesaw. It kind of does, I get you mate, it does. Yeah. <laughs> it's not a seesaw though, Dad, it's a big tree. Jason, you're playing on the seesaw with my sled. <laughs> Two Islas, he's talking about the bags. Oh, I get it. Hello, bye. <laughs> <laughs> Haven't seen this view in over a year, but this place is amazing because of this. <gasps> you guys cannot possibly even get the scope of how pretty this is on this camera, but it is the most stunning view ever. You just come to like a summit in the middle of the woods where it just clears. The forest is totally clear. It's like a forest a fire break in the forest. And then you've just got this. It's like the edge of the earth. You just gotta be really careful today because it's so icy everywhere. You can see all the ice and everything. And I would not like to fall down there. starting to get dark now it's coming up to dinner time I was gifted this product years ago I'm sure it was years ago it was a long 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 time ago I don't even know where it came from I don't know who sent it I'm presuming it was the company but it just dropped off at our PO box one day and I just never used it and then I forgot about it for ages and ages and somebody prompted my memory on the everything Ingham's group on Facebook which I'm part of and I've decided to get it out and that is an air fryer 
I don't know if this is a good one, a bad one, or what. I've never used an air fryer before. I don't even know what I need to use it. I'm guessing nothing if it fries with air, right? Maybe I got that wrong. I don't know. But I'm going to use it for nothing exciting. I don't even know what you can cook on these things or make on them. I'm just going to use it for chips because all we eat when we have chips is oven chips. And I mean, oven chips are just not the best. So I'm going to try this bad boy out. This little bad boy air fryer. And hopefully we'll be able to have some nice chips on here tonight peel oh yeah oh my gosh you guys i already love this i don't know why it looks so grainy and gray on the camera but it's so nice in real life just click to preheat so now we're waiting for it to heat up so after bathing one very muddy dog and having dinner i just took a delivery of a huge amazon order that i made a few days ago i did not expect it to arrive this soon but i need to finish putting it all away um but basically this is one of the things that i still have to so I need to take upstairs to put away um, is a, a huge solar panel. I've got five of these that have just arrived, plus a ton of other stuff. I've got an absolutely monster of a project modifying the caravan for when lockdown finishes, hopefully at some point in the near future, or this summer, or hopefully whenever uh, lockdown finishes. A monster of a modification program jobby for the caravan. It's gonna be very exciting. I'm gonna take you all along, along the way and show you what I'm doing. Anyway, right now I'm about to do something really nice for Isla because when we revealed Esme's bedroom yesterday, um, Isla was really taken by Esme's LED lights and we didn't even consider them as an option for Isla's bedroom. I had already ordered three sets of them for something I'm using them in the caravan for so we've decided that we're gonna donate one of those sets to Isla tonight and we're gonna make her bedroom look super super jazzy with LED lights and we also got some very nice, what are they called? Fundra bed? Like fairy lights from Drew Bed as well, so to make a little den look super, super cute. Because it's a really nice little snug space now. I'm gonna wrap some nice twinkle lights all underneath here, make it a really cozy little reading den for her. So these are the lights. These are the LED strip lights. It's a 10 meter strip, and it comes with like a reel, the lights on a reel like this. And you just kind of unravel it as it goes, and you take the backing off of it, and the backing's super sticky. It's like the, the 3M sticky stuff on the back of it and it just sticks to anything so it's really really easy to put up and use and then you get a remote control with it which you can change all the lights or the different colors that you want or have them flash in different patterns that you want them to flash it's um it's super super cool so really easy to put up as well if anyone's interested in getting some of these because i know i've had a lot of questions on the vlog tonight about where do we get them from for Esme's room there'll be a link in the description box to them on amazon a sweaty 40 minutes later and isla's leds are looking so cool Oh my gosh, you can't really see them on the camera because they're just like, like one big old white blur right now. Let me turn the light down, see if I can pick them up then. Should I turn it on to a different Yeah, change the colour, yeah. Whoa! And so so cool! cool. Um, and because you can't just go uh, like that, facing right there, you have to be right in the point, so you have to be down there. Oh, here on the bed like that for you. That's right, so the uh, the lights have got like an infrared sensor on them and we've hidden it behind the wardrobe. It's the same in Esme, so you just have to point the, the like like you point a TV remote, yeah. a TV, you just point it at the sensor and you can change the lights to whatever you want. Yeah. So while looking, you can sit in your bed, just point it to the sensor over there, down the wardrobe, and then change them and they'll look amazing. And then, yeah. not only that, but we've got a den all wired up, looking amazing, with lots of twinkle lights. I don't think I've done the neatest job of these, to be fair, I think that might just like, it's very hard weaving them through the slats, it took a while, so I might might tweak these tomorrow, but I think that they look, they look in real life, they look so cool and cozy. So sweet. What, baby? I can play music, because why do they have musical notes on them? I'm not sure I'll read. They might follow like the beat of music. If you've got music on, like the lights might flash to it. That's what they might do. You can put, they're really cool, you can put timers on them so you could have them go off after like two hours or one hour or three hours. There's loads of cool, you can make them flash. I'm not gonna do that in case there's anybody watching with epilepsy or anything like that, or sensitive to light, because they're very bright when they do that, but they look wicked, Isla. Yeah. You happy? Yeah, I'm really happy. Okay, so Isla's desperate to show you guys, and I think it looks really cool for anyone that wants to watch, so trigger warning, there's gonna be flashing lights in the next few seconds, so anybody that's sensitive to light, has photo sensitive epilepsy or anything like that, probably wanna look away. Are you ready, Isla? So you can turn them into disco mode. <laughs> This is really cool. This is how I was gonna sleep every night. Not with this mode. With disco mode on. No. <laughs> <laughs> anyway, my boy, you ready for your milkies? No, he's sat with mama. No, he does. He wants his milkies. It's time to go get Jace's milk and time to say good night. Thank you so much for watching this video. Make sure you hit the thumbs up if you enjoyed and subscribe if you're not already already subscribed. And we'll see you tomorrow at 5 p.m. I haven't said that subscribe line for so long. I feel like alien. Coming out of my mouth then. Like, uh, what are you spewing verbal diarrhea for my friend? Anyway, we'll see you tomorrow at five o'clock. Good night, guys.